Former Minister of the Public Service Jennifer Westford and personnel office in that ministry, Margaret Cummings, appeared in court today Wednesday. They were charged with four counts of attempting to commit larceny on eight vehicles and for the commission of a fraud. They were both granted $2 million worth in bail. The charges are related to eight government vehicles that were transferred to various persons, including the minister. The duo was represented by Keisha Chase, Bibi Shadik, UC Anderson, and Dexter Todd. Westford was charged with four counts of attempting to commit larceny. The allegation states that she sought to transfer four vehicles, the property of the government of Guyana, her employer, to Wayne Walker, Delroy Lewis, herself, and Gary Beaton. This was done between June 17, 2015 and June 23, 2015. In Cummings' case, the information states that on July 18, 2014 and April 15, 2015, she forged receipts with intention to defraud in the names of Delroy Lewis, Gary Beaton, Jennifer Westford, and Wayne Walker. The lawyers chased for Westford and Todd for Cummings in asking the court for the women to be released on their own recognizance said that they were both married, that they had a fixed place of abode, they were not of like risk, and in Westford's case she had an adult child, while Todd said that Cummings is the mother of three including a nursing child. Westford was granted bail in the sum of $200,000 for each of the four charges. Cummings had to make bail in the sum of $300,000 in her two cases. Magistrate Anne McLennan transferred the matter to Court 5, where the two would make an appearance on August 10th next. Reporting for Prime News, Julia Johnson.